What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to the562.org. It's Tyler, and this boys soccer highlight is brought to you by the fine folks at Naples Rib Company. Beautiful evening on the west side, a little frigid for El Clasico as Milliken is in town to take on Cabrillo. The Jags, in their more league opener, won this fixture 2-0 last season to close out league play. Trying to do that again. Meanwhile, Milliken coming off a 1-0 loss against Wilson on Monday, looking for a positive result heading into winter break and the visitors created more chances from the outset. This ball gonna bounce around in the box a little bit. The first attempt will be blocked. It falls to David Villanueva, who pulls his shot wide. Knows it's a missed opportunity there, but he would get a chance shortly thereafter. In the 17th minute, 17 is involved again, a give and go between the two Villanuevas. David to Samani, one touch to control, one touch to slide it home. Great, great goal there by Villanueva. He said after the game he was hungry for that goal coming off that Wilson loss, and the Rams go right through the heart of that Cabrillo defense to take the 1-0 lead in the 17th minute. On the other side, the Jags didn't get much going in the first half. This corner in the 23rd minute led to the only shot for Cabrillo, and it didn't exactly threaten the goal. Meanwhile, Anton Moore asking questions of Daniel Martinez in goal, but a nice save there keeps it 1-0 at the half. The hosts were much more of a threat in the second half, led by Martin Ruiz. This one tipped over the bar by Byron Hernandez. Then again, Ruiz with a firecracker right at the goalkeeper. The Jags then unable to collect the rebound. Who's the president right now? Byron. He's able to keep Cabrillo off the scoreboard. Important stops there. Meanwhile, in the 56th minute, Milliken thought they doubled their lead. David Villanueva slots one home, but his palms are up because so is the flag. One of four offsides called against Milliken. None hurt more than that one to take a goal off the board. Rams also looking to play long on the counter, but check out junior Christopher Barsenas with the brilliant slide tackle and maintains possession. Class defending right there for Cabrillo. The Jags were mostly on the front foot in the second half and are so skilled on the ball. Kike Tamores creates some space, but the shot goes high and wide. Cabrillo actually outshot Milliken in the second half, but credit to the Rams for keying in on Ruiz, throwing multiple defenders at him every time he had the ball, just no room for him to operate. Discipline defending from Milliken late on to protect the lead. They could just push everyone back and stifle the Cabrillo offense as the Rams are able to hold on and collect all three points with a 1-0 victory going into winter break. We want to thank all of our sponsors, including Ocean Law Center, for their support of local sports coverage. If you want to keep up with more League Boys soccer, you are definitely in the right spot. The562.org.